Welcome to Synagogues of California, Part 3. We're checking out the Jewish Houses of Worship of Beverly Hills. And there are more than a half a dozen, as well as the majority are of the Orthodox persuasion. The first is Beth Jacob. It's an Orthodox shul. Kalman Top is Senior Rabbi, and there's an Associate Rabbi, Idir Posey, and an Assistant Rabbi, Aryeh Suffren. It has such a large membership that there are several services going on at the same time. To be exact, seven. There is a Hashkama minion for those who want to pray early, like at seven o'clock in the morning. There's Benny's minion, apparently named for the person who leads it. There's the main service. There's the young professionals. There's an explanatory minion, a junior congregation, and a teen minion. The congregation started in 1925 and originally was called the West Adams Hebrew Congregation because of its location. Originally, it was also considered a traditional conservative type of affiliation. In 1954, it moved to Beverly Hills and switched to being Orthodox due to the influence of its then spiritual leader, Rabbi Dolgan. Prior to that, in 1949, it also started its own day school. In 1959, the name of the school was changed to Hillel Hebrew Academy, and in 1964, it moved into a building down the block from the synagogue where it still flourishes today. The congregation claims to have more than 700 member families. Our next stop is Gem Community Center. It has a Shabbos minion on Saturday mornings as well as a Sunday morning minion. Rabbi Yossi Alulian is its coordinator. The facility is a full-service community center, and the philosophy of the organization is one of Here's a closer look to the front entrance of the GEM Community Center and coming up a look at the sanctuary area when services are held. Of Jewish Outreach. Our next stop is what else? Chabad of Beverly Hills. It has been serving the Beverly Hills community since 1979. Yosef Schusterman is its director. Moshe Kesselman is in charge of adult education, and Mendel Schusterman is in charge of youth direction. Besides the full offering of Shabbat services, it has a daily morning minion throughout the week. And here's Congregation Magin David. Ben Sion Ben Shimon is its rabbi. The practice of the synagogue is Sephardic Orthodox customs. It was founded in September 1936 in Los Angeles and moved to this location in 1994. And this is Nessa Synagogue. It caters to the Iranian Jewish community and employs Sephardic Orthodox customs. The congregation started in 1980 and rented space at Beth Jacob. Its founder, Rabbi David Shofet, still leads services in both Hebrew and Farsi, the Iranian language. There are two other Saturday morning services going on at the same time. It built this educational and cultural center in 2002. Here is the Chabad Persian Youth Center. It's just on the cusps of the Beverly Hills area, and Rabbi Herzl Peer is its director. Its primary focus is to keep and retain an affiliation for Jewish practices and customs among the Iranian youth. Hey, you may not believe this, but there actually is a Reformed temple in Beverly Hills, and you're looking at it. It's Temple Emmanuel. It has Shabbat services both Friday evenings and Saturday mornings. Jonathan Aaron is senior rabbi, and associate rabbi is Sarah Basin. The congregation... We're not sure if this is the same building with a different portal, but this is also the Temple Emanuel in Beverly Hills. It started in 1938. We earlier mentioned the Hillel Hebrew Academy, so this is its building. It's now called the Harkham Hillel Hebrew Academy. We believe that there may also be a minion there held on Shabbat called Yaniv Moshe. However, we have no other information on this. And then there's Young Israel of North Beverly Hills, another Orthodox show. 
Since 2011, Rabbi Penny Dunner has been its spiritual leader. He is also involved with Yeshiva University High School for Boys. The congregation started out in Beverly Hills in 1991 in rented locations. It moved into this building in 2012. It claims to have over 120 member families. When one thinks of Beverly Hills, they also think of entertainment and arts and their performers. So here is a reformed congregation called Temple of the Arts. It's been around for about 30 years, and its spiritual leader is Rabbi David Barron. We conclude this trip and check out our other videos on synagogues across the country and the world.